Welcome back and thanks for joining us on Sour Cakes and Bakes. Today what I'm going to be showing you is how to be making piping gel homemade in the UK. To make the piping gel what you'll need is half a cup of golden syrup, a quarter cup of cold water and a quarter cup of corn flour. You can also flavour your piping gel if you wish and colour it. To start with, with your corn flour and your cold water put them together and just give them a whisk to make sure there's no lumps and it's a nice smooth runny paste once it's all mixed in and it looks like milk i guess there's no lumps and bumps in it you then add your golden syrup you can also buy piping gel ready made or make it at home because i'm guessing you've got all the ingredients in your cupboard get all that golden syrup you then mix this until it's combined once it's all mixed you pop it in the microwave on high heat for two minutes on one minute intervals and you mix it after the minute and then pop it back in for a minute I'll show you what it looks like after it's been in the microwave for one minute This is what it looks like after a minute that it's been in the microwave. Just give it another mix. It does get very hot and start to bubble in the microwave. Once you've done that, pop it back in the microwave for another minute. After the second minute, this is what it will look like. Just give it a good mix. It will be a thick, gloopy consistency. And I should have said if you wanted to colour it after you've done the second minute in the microwave, um, that's when you would colour it or you would flavour it. Here in the UK, we don't actually get light coloured corn syrup. We do, and it's extremely expensive. So our substitute would be golden syrup. And then let it cool down 30 minutes, I'd say, and mix it. Uh, different intervals within those 30 minutes and then that can be stored in the refrigerator in an airtight container um, and you can use it this would be good for piping writing also for sticking things and the water puddle kind of paint effects on cakes hope you have enjoyed watching us at sales cakes and bakes subscribe if you're not already a subscriber like and share the video and leave any suggestions or comments below to let me know what you'd like to see at Sales Cakes and Bakes. Thanks again. Welcome and thanks for joining us on Sales Cakes and Bakes. Today what I'm going to be showing you is how to be making rose out of florist paste. 